Welcome back to Tennis Talk. My name's Cam Williams, and there has been a little bit of a scandal going on in Polish tennis at the moment with the head of the Polish Tennis Association being accused of sexual abuse. And some of the biggest names in Polish tennis have come out and made their comments. So let's have a read of what both Igor Fiontek and Hubi Herkac have had to say about the situation. This is the statement that Hubi Herkac had to say about what's been going on. He says, I support all women and all victims of abuse. No coach or guardian should use their power or position towards anyone. Any aggression, both in sports as well as outside of it, needs to be condemned and punished. I hope that appropriate authorities will react to the press reports on the subject of the head of the Polish Tennis Association, Miroslav Skrzypczynski. I stand with all victims of abuse. Let's go have a read of Igor Fiontek's statement now. I feel that as a current leader of women's tennis, I can't be silent about particular matters. I remember that I appreciate having the freedom to decide whether I want to speak up about something or not. Decide considering my sensitivity, knowledge, boundaries, and strength I have at the moment to support people who suffer or encourage you to do something something like taking care about our mental health. And that's why I know that when it comes to physical abuse or emotional abuse, the most important issue is thinking and being sensitive about victims. And when we speak up about something wrong happening, we need to think about them first and most of all. I'm trying to do this the best way I can. I'm against violence in sports, in tennis, in every discipline, and in everyday life. That's why I consider the articles about the president of the Polish Tennis Association a, a serious matter. Governing bodies should determine what happened, and I hope they will take care of this case after the media wrote about the story of people who they talked with. This is not my role to do the work of governing bodies and journalists, as the matter is too serious and it's about people's life and health. What I feel I can do is to encourage you to look for help when something bad happens in sports communities and in every situation in life when there is a possibility that someone can suffer from physical violence or emotional abuse. If someone suffers because of it, the most important thing is to take care of themselves and seek support. There are hotlines and organizations helping people who suffer because of violence. This can be my role, and this is how I can use my influence here, being a voice who tries to educate and remind that the most significant thing is to look for help when you need it. It's crucial to be sensitive to people who suffer from violence, especially if they don't have tools and strength to speak about it openly. It's crucial to be alert, to speak up, and try to help when we witness someone suffering. Personally, I was lucky to not experience such difficult, terrible situations, and I'm grateful for my dad and for how wisely he managed my career. I have an amazing team, safety, and currently I'm really privileged, but I'm aware that not every athlete could have the same independence. I hope that with exposure of such matters and solving them carefully and fairly, sports will change for the better in Poland and in the world. So there you have it. Long comments there by Igor Fiontek and of course Hubi Hurkacz coming out as well and talking about this situation. It's a very uh, de delicate situation and it's good to see the best player on the men and the women's tour coming out in support of the victim and we'll see what happens with this. You know, it's not too much like what Fiontek said. There's not much else you can do. Uh, you know, encourage that that person gets help and that person gets the support they need. And of course, Hubi Herkesh coming out very strongly as well in his statement. But not much else we can say about this. Let me know down in the comments below. What do you think about this situation? What do you think should happen in this situation? It's a very delicate situation, I know, but, uh, but it's great to see the two best Polish tennis players are coming out in support of the victim.